having experienced so much and learned so much um, throughout your career, maybe there's some insights you can give into finding your passion. How, you know, because there's often, there's a lot of talk about finding your passion. What is your passion? How do you find your passion? Uh, you know, et cetera, et cetera. Do you have any, I don't know, tips, advice, any little nugget that you have specific about passion that you could maybe share or something that you've learned? I think it goes back to, um, you know, a couple of things. First of all, I think that one thing that helped me really learn what I was, what was important to me and where my passion was, was really spending time being introspective. And that was when I went through that moment from being on the mountaintop, going to the valley. That was one of the things I spent probably six months just really analyzing a lot of who I was. Uh, really, again, what made me, what brought me joy um, and where I felt like I had a lot of my gifts were in. Um, the other thing that really made a big difference on that, that was reaching out and finding people that were going to, that could be either a coach or be a mentor to me. And at that point in time in my life, I had no one around me that could help in that area to really be a coach. And so I've, I've reached out and I ended up having three different coaches around me at, the, at any given time. And they really served as guardrails to make sure that I didn't make the same mistakes again. But they also affirmed a lot of the qualities that they saw in me and really felt like, you know, they identified areas that they thought I was really strong in. And I was able to focus in on those and, and really continue to work on those, develop those over, over time to where it really became a, a passion. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Them pouring into you, it helped you get there a lot faster, I'm sure. As a Absolutely. <laughs>